Hey guys, my name's Jamin. Thanks so much for visiting my channel. In this video, I have a Lenovo LOQ 15i Gamer Gen 9 version. I'm gonna show you how to get inside, access your speakers. So first thing guys, power down your computer the correct way. Make sure it's off and unplugged from your charger. We're then gonna flip the computer over to access our bottom case screws. Now you have these four screws along the bottom, one on either side near the middle, and then these four up top for a total of 10 screws. After you get those screws out, you're gonna take your small, flat, plastic pry tool. I say plastic because metal pry tools will tend to scratch your case a lot more than plastic ones will. And I would recommend starting in, in the back corners here. Uh, you're gonna pop it open, you're gonna go around this seam, pop the uh, bottom case up from the computer, then you're gonna go down each side, and then you're gonna finish up on this edge. This edge is the hardest to get off. So I would go from the back to the front on this computer. After you've taken your bottom case off, this is what you're looking at for the inside of your computer. Now as a general computer repair side note, whenever I'm opening a computer, it's sitting on an anti-static pad. Either that or an anti-static bracelet are great ideas to avoid damaging things in your computer when you're working on them. If you need any help with tools or supplies for your computer project, as well as any replacement or upgrade parts for this specific model computer. There'll be a link above, also below in the description. It'll have all those tools and replacement parts for the LOQ-15i. Now, before I do anything in a computer, I will either remove or at least unplug my battery. It makes it safe to work on the computer with as little power as possible running through it. Now, if you guys notice your speakers, they run underneath your battery. You got this speaker over here, this speaker over here, they're connected under the battery. So to get at this, we need to remove your battery. It's held in by four screws. You see these little white arrows with the M2X4L? There's one in each corner. You're gonna take all four screws out and then your battery plugs into the motherboard right here. Now, as you can see in your computer, there's a small grip on either side of that black plug. So you can use your fingernails or a pry tool and you can go one side at a time and pry that out from that plug. As with any computer plugs, you want to avoid pulling on the wires as much as possible. You want to just manipulate that plug whenever possible. Okay, so now that the battery has been removed, we have access to the speaker wires. So these speakers are not actually screwed down. These little white rubber washers that go over the posts. That's for sound insulation, but that's the only way they're held down. So you can wiggle those speakers right off of those posts and get them off. To unrun the wire, there's some tape holding it down at various places. So be careful, but you can just peel that tape up. Um, and then this speaker here is the one that plugs into the motherboard right there. And just like your battery, there is a grip on either side of that plug that you can use your fingernails or a pry tool and wiggle that out. Speaker wires are even more fragile than battery wires, so definitely try to wiggle that out. Don't pull on those wires. When you're putting your speakers back down, make sure um, you put these wires exactly where they are because remember this bottom case is, is, is gonna clip on there and all these little clips here, you, you see, those are gonna snap onto the bottom case. So it's very common for people just to lay this however they feel like, and then when they're trying to force their bottom case on, they actually break these wires. So just make sure that it's run right through here, right around there, exactly how it's supposed to be when you put your speakers back. Last thing I'll shout out as far as speakers, if you guys are trying to troubleshoot some sound issues, um, most likely if you're hearing just really junk bass, Every time the bass kicks in, most likely your speakers are blown. They do need to be replaced. But if you're getting other sound issues where they work sometimes, not other times, maybe the sound isn't as loud as, as, as it could be, it may not be a speaker issue. It may be a driver or an update or a software issue. I will have a link above, also below in the description on how to make sure all your drivers are up to date, all the software, all, all the system updates are run to make sure that it's not that before you come in here and try to physically remove and replace your speakers. So I hope this video was helpful. That's how you access your speakers in the LOQ 15i Gamer. So that's the video guys, I hope it was helpful. If you have any questions, check out the FAQs below in the description. It could save you some time getting an answer. 
If you do need to leave me a question or comment, please do. I do try to get to those a couple times a day at least. To support the channel, please remember to like and share, subscribe if you enjoy this type of DIY tutorials, and for those of you that want to support the channel a little further, you can always leave a small donation, and there's a couple ways to do that. First, right below the video to the right hand side, you'll see the super thanks button. You can click on that. You can select a tip amount here. Second way, you can use your cash app, find me at dollar sign PC helper. You can leave a dollar amount and you can even leave a little note. So thank you so much for watching guys and I look forward to seeing you on my next video.